Birdheim had the lucky assignment. She drew the special straw to get to go to that party tonight. Now, Ashton Kutcher may have snubbed you yes. last night, as we talked about earlier, but you got to talk to plenty of other celebs, huh? Yeah, I may have gotten the cold shoulder from Ashton and maybe a couple of other celebs, but that's okay. You know, I just brush it off and move on. But I did talk to one of Kentucky's biggest celebrities, of course, Coach Cal, and he had a big day yesterday. He got to go to Washington, D.C. and meet our president. I caught up with him and also another former pretty special Wildcat to hear what their trip was like. He was, uh, he was really, he's got a swagger. You know, we like to have it in basketball. He has it. He has a swagger to him. He's uh, knew our players, knew who they were, um, knew my son. I mean, he's really, he was really neat. It was for our basketball players, and our team and our program to have that opportunity was it was really neat. A friend of mine was there said I was moving my hand. Yeah, I was nervous. It's, it was harder to do that than coaching a championship game. And after chatting with us, Coach Cal took time to talk to True Blue fans. Pretty much just show my face, you know, support the cause, uh, have a lot of fun, meet some new people, and just have a good night. If I pick a horse, he may not finish. So I'm like kind of staying away from it. I'm not sure. I was going to go with Daddy Long Legs, but. Everyone's probably going to go with him, you know, so I'm going to try to find somebody else tonight. See who's performing. Uh, last year, boys the men, uh, a couple of my teammates and I were doing a little solo action up there. So uh, hopefully somebody else comes out there and have a good time. Yeah, you heard right. Coach Cal said our president has swagger. Now, I do believe Chris and Nicole, isn't that a requirement to be the president of the United States? I'm not sure. Back to you guys. Apparently it is these days. <laughs> yeah. yeah.